Hey guys, welcome back. It is the start of a new series. Oh, it's the one you've been waiting for. We are building London. Let's get straight to it. New game. And down here, the Sky's Greater London map. Oh yeah, all that effort that we've put in. Building that map, now we're going to take advantage of it. The city name will, of course, be London. And left-hand traffic, for sure. Which is going to be fun. After I've built New York and got used to all the right-sided traffic, now we're going to do left-hand traffic so I can get all the junctions wrong again. Let's jump straight in. We're in, and it starts. I just take a look at this for a second. What do you think? I think this turned out like a pretty nice looking map. I've got to say, I really, really like how this has turned out. No, I, I don't want to blow my own trumpet, but I think I did a half decent job on this map. And here is our starting square, our starting tile. And we start out here in the west. This is the um, the M4 going off here. This is the uh, the M um, the M40. Well, it's the A40, and it becomes the M40. Right. What are we going to be doing in this series? Well, obviously we're going to be building London, but let's try and be a little bit more specific. So, let's talk mods first of all. I'm I'm using all of the mods that I've been using up to this point, like in the previous series. So things like the the map overlays, the terrain tools. Um, the 25 tile unlock, the tree brush, the auto bulldoze. And I'll include a list of all the mods that I'm using in the video description. So if you want them, you can go and get them on Steam Workshop. But I'm also adding new mods. And there's going to be quite a lot of new mods coming into this. For example, precision engineering. Uh, I'm going to be using things like the, um, the multi-track mod for transport. But I'll talk about that in a second. Uh, I'll probably be using the, um, the something like Traffic Manager or, or one of the Traffic Manager mods because I think I'm going to need it to be able to do some of the things that you need to do in the city. Uh, assets. I'm going to be using loads of assets. All the major landmarks I'll be putting in. I, I mean, you name it. If it's, if it's there, I'm going to put it in. You know what? While I'm yakking, I'm going to start unlocking some of these tiles. Um, actually... I'm not, because we've kind of got a limit on how much cash we've got. So, uh, I, I, I'm not. I'm going to unlock some of them, but probably not all of them. Mind you, we start off with 750,000. So, I mean, come on. Um, you know what? I'm going to unlock down here as well. And we'll, we'll kind of live with that for now. Oh, shall I unlock this one as well? Yes, I'll unlock that one as well. Cool. They're not, they're, they're not that expensive, for heaven's sake. Right, what was I talking about? Uh, landmarks. Oh, you name it. From, from like... Tower Bridge, uh, like Buckingham Palace, if I can never find an asset for that. The Shard, the Gherkin, football stadiums like Wembley, the, um, I don't know, Arsenal, the Emirates Stadium, Stamford Bridge, Chelsea, my team. Uh, all kinds of stuff like that. Like the Albert Hall, like anything that I can get hold of. If you find any London-based assets, um, then drop me a line. And uh, I'll try and put together a collection of all the London-based assets uh, on the Steam Workshop. I think that would be kind of useful for anybody that's doing this. Um, transport. I'm going to be putting in, obviously, the all the major road systems. And I'll be using overlays to make sure that that's accurate. If you want to know how these uh, overlays work, go watch the series that I just did on building this map. It explains exactly how to, how to install them, how to use them, and all that kind of stuff. What else? Um, the, all the trains, I'm going to be putting in the major train stations. Now, the, the busiest train station in London is actually Clapham Junction. It's got like 14 platforms, and it's kind of... Where's, where's Clapham Junction? Clapham Junction is going to be kind of like over here-ish. Um, whether we'll be able to duplicate like the whole thing, I don't know. But we'll, I'll certainly try using things like um, the four-track stations four platform stations and see if we can do something to kind of kind of sort of do it now that means using mods like traffic manager and multi-lane um there's a multi-lane multi-track mod that you need installed as well so i'll be going through those when i do them um the underground now the underground the famous london underground map we're going to be trying to recreate this i'll be putting in all the lines i'll be color coding them doing all of that stuff the dlr now um, I can't go over there, but hang on, let me go up to here. Um, over in this area, this is Docklands, this loop of the river. 
This is Docklands. And there's a thing called the Docklands Light Railway. We just call it the DLR. And it's a it's a light railway. It's um, and it's automated. There's no drivers. It's all done. It's all handled by robots, computers, all that kind of stuff. Uh, but it's it's pretty small. The stations are very small. And on this scale, I'm not sure I can do it. So I may have to do that with subways rather than with trains. I don't know. We'll see as we go along. What else? Um, also, as I go through it, and like, and like when I'm putting the bridges in and the major landmarks and stuff, I'm going to try and make it interesting. I'm going to try and include some, some history, some trivia, some interesting facts, some funny stories, all that kind of stuff. Um, now, the, obviously, there's going to be a lot of stuff which is repetitive, like, like laying in all the roads and... and you know stuff like that when i get to those kind of bits where i'm like okay i need to i need to like lay in a whole bunch of roads i'm going to time lapse that stuff and um, i'll try and include up the top uh, a skip option i'll try and put an annotation in so you can skip those bits if you don't like time lapse if you do like time lapse you'll have fun watching those bits look we've got a train we've got a train running through yep that's going out to the um, to the southwest of england but he's got a long journey because this um, this train track actually doesn't go anywhere. He's got to go all the way up here to the uh, to the to the wet the western line, which uh, actually goes out here. Right H now, how are we going to do this? Because I'm playing this with the um, with all the unlocks, but I'm not playing it with unlimited money um, because that's just I think playing it with un unlimited money is kind of wrong. We're, so we're going to have to build some stuff. To get us going so i thought actually i am going to unlock some more tiles um what we're going to do is we're going to try and do some like some like maybe some farming towns out in the uh, out in the outskirts uh to kind of fund things early on and then we'll start to build up in the center and, and and put in all the infrastructure and all that kind of stuff so we'll we'll kind of do it as we go along and i i I think this is going to be epic, guys. I think this is going to be right. So you know what? Let's um let's actually do some building. Now we've got a whole bunch of these highway connections which lead out to um kind of uh, well this is actually the M25, which is the the London Orbital Motorway, which is a, a freeway that runs all the way around um the, the whole of London, just a big circle. Uh, and I'm, we're going to be using these so. We can have because we've got lots of connections to the outside, and there are lots of connections. There's got, like, like I don't know, there's like over ten highway connections out to the outside. Uh, we can put in little isolated things if we want. So we're going to put stuff in, um, and the, like I said, these are going to be kind of um, little farming communities for now to just to get us started, get some cash coming in. We'll put some infrastructure in, and then we'll kind of like move on from there. Okay, enough talk. It's time to break ground. How are we going to do this? Well, you can probably see down here, I've just marked in a bunch of trees to mark in some roads. You know what? I'm actually going to... I'm going to go crazy. I'm going to buy these tiles up here because otherwise it's going to drive me crazy not being able to move the map around. Let's go back. Let's go back. Right, so, yeah. yeah. So I've marked in... Uh, with uh, with trees some roads now let me show you now I'm using map overlays and I've picked up a more uh, a more detailed map and let me let me just raise the map up so you can see and you can see these roads are uh, being marked in and see that's not quite lined up but I did this with the with the big map overlay that I was using and now I've brought in a more detailed one and it, let's just bring this up and you can see it's pretty much right all the way down here so I think that little bit at the top I think I'll trust this map more than the other one so all I do go over here take out these uh, and don't worry you're not I'm not going to be like spending hours like messing around with trees all the time this um, this area this is pearly this this place D down here this is pearly and then we're going up to um south croydon um well let me let me get rid of these trees out here because i'm gonna i'm gonna mark in some uh, some roads and like i said I, i'm gonna show you how i'm gonna do it on the first one but other you know when i do it in the future i'll 
I'll do it offline. So, right, cool. There we go. And like, how much of this am I going to do? Now, this over here, um, we've got a railway station. If if I uh, if I zoom out and bring the map up, this um, that down here, there's another train station. I need to raise the map. So let me raise the map up. Right now, this down here, this is Pearly. Uh, railway station and then we've got other railway stations going up here and what I'm going to do is I'm going to pick out certain ones that I'll put in um, I'm not going to put in every one because it would be kind of ridiculous but we are going to put some in so we're going to have a road but it's obviously not going to connect to anything going down there um, what other roads do I want to mark in right down there right across there like that Right, okay, that, that's enough for now. So, so that you guys can like, get the idea of what I'm doing. All right, now I've got to try and make some sense of this. Now, um, I've got road going off there, haven't we? And this is where I'm going to be referring to the map quite a lot. Right, so we've got road going off over there. And these two trees are wrong. So let's, um, let's put this, mark this road in kind of heavily. Right, so we've got some kind of intersection here um, so now how are we going to represent that and we've got like well, we've got the highways coming in we've got yeah da, 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 da. okay okay we've got the two highways there that's fine now we're going to be going down to, I think, four lane. And it's going to be with trees, I think, because Pearl is quite a nice area. Uh, immortalized in the Monty Python sketch, of course. Pearly Squire, famous place. Say no more. Nudge, nudge, wink, wink. Can you see what like a massive undertaking this is? This is gonna this is an enormous project. This is gonna be so much fun. We're gonna have like an accurate representation of Pearly. <laughs> oh god, I can't believe I'm doing this. I can't believe I'm doing this. There. Have you ever like? Uh, can you imagine like doing the? Uh, I'm gonna do the whole of London like this. But see, things like that are gonna be a problem because the junctions are just too, on this scale. The junctions are just too damn close together. So sometimes, like there, I'm not gonna put that junction in because it would kind of be silly.
So I think I'm, I'm, I'm going to put that train line in. We'll put Pearly Station in down here and we'll bring the train line up around here because um, I think that'd be quite cool. Right, so we've got enough of that in. Uh, do I want to put like any of these little roads in? Yeah, probably not at this point. Right, you know what? That is probably enough to get us started. Um, I'm just looking in here. Have we got any any roads that I could kind of sensibly put in? And I think the answer is, yeah, I can probably put this road in. So we'll put this road kind of going like that, like the more like there. Yeah, that makes more sense. Now this area, there's kind of nothing in here. We've got the, the Pearly Way playing fields. Excellent. Uh, and again, we can make decisions about, like, do we want to fill that in a little bit? Or just leave it as it is? And I think, to be honest, we'll probably just leave it as it is. It's not hurting anybody. Right, okay. We've got a little bit done. What are we going to do now? Right, well, to get us going, because we've actually got to, like, make a profit... Right, I'm going to put in a little farming community. So, right, should we do it? Let's do it. So we've got our first zoning done. Excellent. Now we need some uh, we need some water. How on earth are we going to do the water? That's a very very good question. Actually, you know what? I'm going to go up to this map because um, I'm going to buy some more map sections. I'm going to buy this section. And I'm going to buy this section. And then this section and this section and you're probably wondering why I'm doing that but you shouldn't be because it's kind of obvious <laughs> let's be honest what I'm going to do is I'm going to go up to this area here and I'm going to put in some sewage treatment oh yeah so we bang a sewage treatment plant in like right on the corner there right so we've got our first sewage treatment and then where are we going to put our water pumps well we're going to like for now I think we're gonna we're gonna start off putting some uh, some sewage treatment, so uh, some water pumps, like just a couple of pumps over there. Right now I've got to hook them up. So the first thing we do is hook up the water pipes, and then I'm just gonna run this like across here, and then I'm gonna try and sort of do this to follow the roads because certainly in the UK and I think in most places the water pipes follow the roads which is why when uh, when we whenever there's a, there's a burst pipe or anything they go and dig up the bloody roads and cause traffic chaos bit more this is a, this is like a huge project is that this is gonna be like massive I'm doing one tiny little bit we've got the entirety of London to do for God's sake this I am loving this right so we've put that in we now need to hook our pipes up to the sewage which is up here so we'll link that and I've got to kind of see where I can come through so I've got to come across here and then down ah great cool. 
can just bring that like straight down to here. There we go. Cool. So we've done that. Right, electricity. How the hell are we going to do the electricity? Well, I think what we'll do for now, like just for now, I'm going to take a road. I'm going to take a regular road. And I'm going to take a regular road like up here into the middle of nowhere. Oh, are you going outside the border? All right. Bring a road up here into the middle of nowhere. Now, uh, we'll put in, I think for now, we should probably put in like Gula's power plant, coal power plant. So we'll pop one of those in. What else are we going to need? Well, we're going to need an incinerator. So we'll pop that in at the same time. Boom, boom. So we've got those two things done. Now that's going to supply uh, electricity to this area, which is great, but... We always have to remember, because I always blum and forget, to run the power cables up to the water. So I've got to run power cables all the way over to there. And where's my water pumps? My water pumps are over here. So let's put that in there. Come across the railway track. Come across the A3. It's like all the way over here so again how am i going to do this you know what let's see if i can hop across there we go and we'll hook it up we'll hook it up around the back Ooh, uh, boom cool then i think we'll probably take a line across here and then we'll see where stuff starts to form and we'll we'll like hook it up um, yeah, we can run lines in. Okay, you know what? Let's let's get it running. Let's get it running and see. Where's our first building? What's our first building going to be? We've got residential demand. Now this is hooked up, isn't it? Have I like I'm, I'm trying to spot like what's my boneheaded mistake this time? Because there always is one. Uh, I've zoned the stuff in. We've got. Residential demand. This is connected, this highway. So, why aren't we getting houses? Oh, hang on a second. We're getting houses. Woohoo! Right, pause that because we need electricity. So, let's run some electricity lines. And we call these pylons. I don't know about anywhere else, but we call these electricity pylons. And we'll run this. Yeah, screw it. We'll run it across that corner and up to this corner and up here, across the back of here, down here, and boom! Right, we've got power to this area, or at least part of it. Right, let's carry on and let it run. What I'd like to do by the end of this episode is actually like have like a positive cash flow. Um, and what I'll do, like, I'll, I'll probably put in a few of these areas around the outside um, where they've got easy access to the highways, um, just so that we're bringing the cash in, and then we'll kind of, you know, develop the more difficult areas, which are going to be more expensive, or like once we've got some cash flow coming in. But I'm going to try and mix it up. So I'm going to try and, you know, like, like put in these areas in. Like if I put another one of these in, I'll just time lapse it um, because we want to see the cool stuff. We want to see all the landmarks in the center and we want the intricate transport systems and all of that stuff. We've got houses. You know what? Should I speed this up? Yes. For God's sakes, guys, speed it up. Right. So they're not complaining about anything at the moment. We've got, got oh, hang on a second. I need to check. Are these connected to the water? No, they're not. Ha 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 ha. See? Knew there was something. Let's take that. Run that up here. Up here. And then across. There. There we go. So now we've got water. So now we've got garbage. Excellent. Next. Right. Now we're getting commercial in down here. Which is beautiful. Now, there's a, there's a mod, which is, um, or a bunch of mods, for UK retail uh, outlets. And I haven't got those installed at the moment, but I think for the next episode, I'm going to get that installed. 
so that we um, we can start have seeing those because they're they're pretty nice actually. I was quite impressed when I saw that. I'll dig that out, and of course, all the links for all the mods should be in the video description. Right. Oh, we got a we got a building burned down, so we're going to need to start putting our services in. We are currently losing four thousand per month, so I'm actually going to wait. I'm actually going to wait because I don't want to get like so far in debt that I can't get out of it with the cash that we've got. Now, oh, 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 but before before we do anything else, I've got to put in districts. So we want our farming district. So now this is going to be this is going to be pearly, All right? So we'll have a district which is going to be this area like this. So that's going to be that's going to be pearly. And then this area here. Actually, let's look at the map. Let's look at the map. Let's bring the map up for a second. Oh, wrong, went the wrong way. This, yes, this is South Croydon, this area. So, you know what? Actually, the, the nice thing is that you can bring that map up. And then you can paint it in. So, this is going to be like, so this area down here is going to be South Croydon. Cool. And then I'm going to make both of these farming districts. Cool. Right, we get rid of the map again. Start this up again. Well, and we should hopefully start to get... My mouse is going crazy, guys. So while I put this in, we should start to get farms forming. So this is going to be um, south... Uh, what was it? South Croydon. There you go, your name's spelt right. And now, Pearly. Pearly, Squire. Famous place. There we go. So, Pearly. We've got Pearly, we've got South Croyd. Look, we've got farms going in, guys. And because this is a nice fertile area, uh, we're getting lots of actual farms forming. Oh, awesome source. Now, how much are we losing at the moment? We're losing like 3,600 at the moment. Uh, our population is starting to grow though. And the taxes are coming in. And this, this loss number is going down. Now what we can do to help. Is we can go to um, taxes. And we can increase our taxes a little bit. And I think it's probably safe to take everything up to 11%. So let's take taxes up across the board. Uh, we're only putting in low density at the moment. So let's up them all to 11%. That means we are now losing oh, 2000, 2008. It's coming. It's coming, guys. And you, this is actually looking quite nice, I have to say. You know what? what oh, now, what are they complaining about? Oh, they're complaining about crime. We need to put some services in. We do need to put some services in. So let's put in a police station. So just we'll put in just a little police station for now. Now I'll put it on a main road somewhere. Um, how about we put it like up there? What's that, that coverage like? See, the coverage with these things is so awful. Like, it's... Absolutely dreadful. So we've got to put another one in down there. Like, which is just kind of ridiculous. And it's going to be the same with the with the fire service. The coverage on 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 this is just like appalling. Um, so we've got to put. Oh man, we've got to put like separate fire services in for Pearly and South Croydon. You're kidding me kidding me well we're gonna have to do it then well in that case i'm putting that next to that one this one i'm gonna put somewhere else i think i'll probably maybe put it over here there we go avoid the place burning down at least we're gonna need people for uh, somewhere for people to burn their grannies that's for darn sure i'm probably gonna put that in the middle somewhere the coverage is fairly good so let's put that in the middle there and then what the hell else 
do we need? Oh, we're going to need a hospital as well, aren't we? Oh, and we're going to need a school. Oh, great. It's never ending the amount of stuff you need to put in. Medical clinic. You know what? We're going to have a medical clinic over here in, um, in South Croydon. And the people from Purley, well, they're just going to have to travel. And it is what it is. Get over it. Right, now we're going to do educate. We'll, we'll put in an elementary school. Now, where do I want an elementary school? Most of my residential is over here. I'm thinking we maybe put it... See, I've got farmland in the middle. I need to see. Yeah, you know what? Let's put the elementary school, I think, over here. That would probably make more sense. Yeah, yeah. We'll put the elementary school in there. All right, cool. All right, I like it. Right, we've got all of our basic services. So we are now losing just over 4,000. But our population is really starting to grow a little bit now. We're bringing in, uh, what, 40, 50 people a week. Our population's over 1,000, guys. Only another 11,999,000 to go. And then we'll have the population of Greater London, which is about 12 million. Right, this is all starting to fill in now. We've got the commercial going on. We've got our farmland going on. Now, what I want to look at, and we'll, you know what, we'll, we'll, we'll look at this, I guess, while we're, while we're waiting for stuff to fill in. I'm not leaving this episode until we get profitable. Which, uh, which might take a minute or two. So you know what? Uh, you know what? We'll let this build. We'll let this develop. Right? And I'll, I'll show you when we're actually going to get into positive territory. Well, I, let me tell you. I was a little bit nervous. Because right on the edge of bankruptcy. We've just gone positive. We're, we're minus 15,000. But we've just gone positive. Hooray! And now... With a bit of luck, don't go down again. It's going down. Go back up. We've still got people moving in. This is going to start to go up now. So what, what I'm going to do, I will let this run. And uh, hopefully we'll get to, we'll get back into a positive cash flow situation. Uh, you know what? Oh, man. I'm, I'm lo it's only episode one. I'm loving this already. You know, I want to go to the free camera because I want to show you that... Here's our, you know what, let's get rid of, let's get rid of the map. And here we are, in the, on the, on the south edge of the, uh, of the Thames estuary. The Thames in the distance. With our first little towns, Purley and South Croydon. Little farming community going on. And I gotta say guys, don't you think it looks pretty? I think it looks really pretty. It's gonna be epic, I'm telling you, it's gonna be epic. If you enjoyed this, hit the like button. Make sure you subscribe because it's going to be great. And I'll see you for the next one, guys. Peace out.